Included with the Starboard Link Easy product are seven reflective bars, one USB cable, two corner clips, one cable holder, one cable cover, one digitizer, and for non-magnetic installations, one metal plate, screws, and command strips. Before beginning the installation process, make sure the latest version of Starboard software is installed on your computer. Launch the Starboard Link Easy Setup Wizard from your computer, which should be located in your Programs or Applications folder by default. Step 1. Before beginning installation, make sure you are installing the device on a flat surface, such as a wall or a whiteboard. Keep at least two reflective bar lengths of open space in both vertical and horizontal directions. Step 2. Project your computer screen onto the surface where Starboard Link EZ will be installed. Step 3. Keep a minimum space of two digitizer heights or 10 inches above the projection area. Step 4. Keep a minimum space of one inch on the left, bottom, and right side of the projection area to attach the reflective bars. Step 5. Prepare the digitizer for installation by connecting the USB cable to the back of the digitizer. Do not plug the cable into your computer yet. Step 6. Attach the cable cover to the back of the digitizer. Step 7. Select either the magnetic or non-magnetic installation method. For demonstration purposes, this installation will be completed using the magnetic method. Step 8. Attach the digitizer to the installation surface above the triangle mark and parallel with the projection area. Keep a space of one digitizer height or five inches between the projection area and the digitizer. For non-magnetic surface installation, install the metal plate before attaching the digitizer. Remove the paper backing of the command strips on the back of the metal plate, and then attach it to the installation surface where the digitizer will go. Step 9. Attach the reflective bars to the installation surface on the left, bottom, and right sides of the projection area. The reflective bars should reach the top of the digitizer. Make sure the silver sides of the bars face the projection area and that there are no gaps between the reflective bars. Secure the corner clips. For non-magnetic surface installation, install the reflective bars using the command strips provided. Secure the command strips to the back of each reflective bar and attach them to the installation surface as seen in the magnetic installation method. Step 10. Attach the cable holder to the installation surface outside of the reflective bars. Secure the USB cable into the holder. Step 11. Plug the USB cable into your computer. Step 12. Step 12 is the reflective bars check. If needed, adjust the reflective bars on the left, bottom, and right sides until they pass the test. Step 13 is the digitizer adjustment. Wait a moment and do not touch anything on the installation surface while the digitizer adjustment is in progress. After the digitizer adjustment is completed, step 14 will take you through the calibration process. From this point, operate the wizard using your finger. Touch the center of the blinking red targets numbered 1 through 9 with one finger. Release your finger from the surface after touching the center of each target. Step 15. The Starboard Link EZ Setup Wizard has finished successfully and your Starboard is ready to use. Make sure to run the wizard again whenever you change the device location.